Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to download the Windows 11 installation ISO file. So as of right now, Windows 11 is not out, but they're just starting to release some beta, you know, development uh, test installations that you could do. So if you're part of the uh, Microsoft Windows Insider program, you could get some of these. But the way that works is you have to configure it on your computer and then it will download it as an update. To your computer and then install it on your computer but if you want to actually have the installation files to do a clean install either on a different computer so you don't risk messing up your computer or even better yet on a virtual machine you could download the iso file and do it that way so there's you know ways you could find it on the internet but one way that worked good for me was to go to this uupdump.net website which i'll put in the description and then once you're there you just have to go down and look for windows 11 and look for the right architecture. So I'm gonna, you know, I have an Intel processor, so I'm gonna use the AMD 64. So you click on this, and then you pick your language, click on next, and then choose your edition. I would leave all these checked because then when you do the installation, you'll have all these options to uh, choose from when you install. Click on next, and then you want to pick the download and convert to ISO option, and then just uncheck everything here. And then click on create download package. And that's going to make a zip file, save that uh, somewhere where you'll be able to find it. And then once you're there, you're going to want to extract the zip file. And then within the zip file, you're going to look for this file here, UUP download Windows CMD. So Windows command script file and Windows is going to try and stop you from running it because it doesn't know if it could trust it so you click on more info click run anyways and now it's going to download all the files here and this is going to take a long time so since I already have these files I'll see if I could stop it okay and so what it'll do is once you're done there you'll have all these files actually when it's when it goes to that screen downloading you're going to get to a the black screen and you're going to get to a blue looking screen here i took a screenshot of it and it'll be doing some more things and blah 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 and then at the very end it'll say press zero to exit I figured i'd just take a picture rather than you know record 30 minutes of downloads and unzipping and then once you're there finished you'll be able you'll have this folder here that you could go to and then you'll have your ISO file right there. So from that, you could use your burning software and make a DVD out of it, or you could load it into your virtualization software and install Windows. And I actually have done that here in VirtualBox, and I have my Windows 11 running right there. So now that that's done, I'll probably make a video on how to do the installation of Windows 11 in VirtualBox. So you might want to look for that video, and then you could... Uh, follow along and install it yourself and then you can start playing with it. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.